Hey, what's up guys? Anthony Alfredo here. Monday Night Racing League Championship tonight at the Carolina Esports Hub. Never been here before, but it looks like a pretty sick venue in the pictures. Emily's with us. She's going to support me, maybe stand behind me and spot. Um, kind of last second uh, opportunity to come here and race live. The championship four are all on sim seats, driving simulators on stage. Uh, once I get in, I'll show you guys what it looks like inside. But I'm going to be at a desk on like a wheel and pedal setup. And I haven't raced on something like that in a super long time. So it's going to be tricky, uh, but it should be fun. I'm just excited to be a part of it. First big live iRacing event ever, I think. So it's huge for the esports community, sim racing industry as a whole. Uh, rep an X set, of course. Rep the set. Got my Anthony Alfredo hat. Get on anthonyalfredo.com. Let's get ready. All right, so session's loading up. This is the rig we're working with, Logitech G29 wheel and pedal set. This, I don't know what this computer is. It's tiny, but it's fast as heck. They got fiber optics here too, which is super great. Uh, but this is pretty much how I started iRacing. I started sim racing on a desk uh, with a wheel and pedal set just like this, pedals on the floor, wheel clamped to the desk, and on a 20 inch monitor just like this one. So it's gonna be tricky going back to these old ways. Uh, it's, it's gonna be tough after being spoiled with my sim seats driving simulator, D-Box haptics, all the really great equipment on there. Gonna have a lot less feel, it's gonna be challenging, but gonna try to get some practice in here, just to have a little bit of reps, get comfortable before the race so we can still do well. But all in all, it's just fun to be a part of this. It's a huge step for uh, for the sim racing community, iRacing, uh, Monday Night Racing League, and all of our sponsors, partners, uh, and esports as a whole, honestly. Monday Night Racing League Season 4 Championship. The Championship 4 is up on stage. I'm at my desk with the wheel and pedal set. This is going to be hard to race like this, but it's going to be a blast. Be sure to tune in. iRacing is broadcasting it live. Uh, we got a ton of fans here to watch and be a part of it, which is super cool as well. Should be a great time. California, it's Paul Irving. At the start, hopped on the rig and laid down a solid lap. Qualified P10. Did not expect to be top 10 on this setup, but I'm proud of it. And uh, we'll try to finish up there as well. So it should be a good time. Everybody tune in and enjoy the race. Wow, everybody. Absolutely unbelievable event last night. Super proud of Monday Night Racing. I think when we all started that league, we never expected it to get to this point. I think we hoped it would, but we never expected it to get here this quickly. Uh, so it was a huge accomplishment and a big deal for the sim industry as a whole. Uh, sim racing, iRacing, and, and honestly just esports in general. So I was very proud, thankful to be a part of it. Hope you guys enjoyed some of the behind the scenes footage. Had a blast racing. Congrats to Adam Cabot on the championship. He actually raced his way into Monday Night Racing through my league, the Esports Racing League. Earned his spot in uh, MNR as a regular driver in the Pro Series. And he just won the championship. So that was pretty surreal. It was pretty cool. Um, appreciate him thanking me on stage at his championship interview. Uh, David Childhouse came on P2. They had an insane battle for the win. As I was racing, I was hearing the crowd roar, just going absolutely wild. I kind of wish I just pulled over and watched the watched it because it was intense. And there's nothing like racing live in, por in person or competing live in person, uh, no matter the sport, whether you're gaming or uh, playing anything else. It was just cool to experience that for the first time as a, as a gamer. So um, very thankful. I hope you all enjoyed it. 
hopefully it's the beginning of uh, a lot more and maybe we could see some of the bigger events like the world championship series drivers compete in something like that and i think we can make that happen through the erl maybe so uh erl comeback soon possibly but i hope you guys enjoyed leave a like if you did leave a comment let me know what you thought uh carolina esports hub was amazing venue in charlotte check it out if you're ever in the area looking forward to going to more events just like that all in all appreciate you all tuning in and i'll talk to you all later